Guys, today we're going to give you a few tips on how you can improve as a defender. Now, Jolto went to Monaco to speak to Jibril Sidibe, and to show you guys what he's actually talking about, I stayed home in Denmark, where I brought the Finnish Mountain. It's my good colleague Timo, who happens to be an ex-pro. <laughs> and as you can see, also a pretty kick-ass defender. <laughs> Guys and girls, welcome to AS Monaco Training Ground. Beautiful weather and I'm joined by Jibril Sidibe, who's today going to give us some tips on how to become a better defender. You guys have been asking for this and today we're going to learn some cool stuff. Let's go. Déjà, il faut que il faut être très rigoureux, très concentré. Et puis en tant que défenseur, c'est une grande motivation de jouer contre des grands joueurs et puis de se dire qu'il faut commencer par gagner le premier duel, c'est le plus important. Les deux, les deux critères sont importants. Le plus important, c'est de regarder le ballon, de jamais quitter le ballon des yeux, et puis après de s'adapter, et puis euh, travailler ses appuis pour essayer de contrôler l'adversaire. How important for defenders is like being at the right place and playing with the like the defensive line as a unit. Ça dépend de la position de l'adversaire. C'est-à-dire que si l'adversaire il va vite, bon, on essaie de reculer, reculer pour essayer de le freiner. Si uh, c'est quelqu'un qui est dans le dribble et tout, on garde les appuis et puis on regarde le ballon. Une fois que l'adversaire va se fatiguer, c'est là qu'on intervient. to give only one piece of advice to some young kids who are going to watch this video. What would you say, like, what can they do on the field to become better defenders? Bah, jamais quitter le, le ballon des yeux, tout simplement, et puis rester concentré. guys and girls, that was Jibril Sidibet talking to us and giving some awesome tips on how to become a better defender. You guys have been asking for it like I already said, and we're gonna keep them coming. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the episode. If you want to see more stuff like this, make sure you subscribe to our channel by clicking the green bubble somewhere over here. And if you want to see more stuff we did here at the AS Monaco Training Ground, click on the videos right down here. That's it for today. See you next time.